What is up guys? Welcome to the Big Unbox where we do that small tech and today I am back with another big unboxing for you for the OnePlus 6T and today we're back with a case from VRS. This is going to be their wallet series. It's going to be called a D Wallet 2 Unbox. Do a quick review. As always we'll throw up the link in the video description if you guys want to check this one out. So this one should be one of those wallet cases that still keeps a minimalist phone cover. It's not going to add too much bulk hopefully to your phone it does only carry two cards which is kind of disappointing at least that's what it says on the actual presentation online which is disappointing i'd like to see maybe three two's fine if you get basically a driver's license and maybe one credit card if you're going out for the evening but to most people that's probably not enough for everyday use but 24.99 is the price it was definitely steep so we'll see if it's going to be a hit or a miss for the one plus 6t this is what you're going to get in terms of presentation got the d wallet right there one plus 6t VRS on the back is going to tell you a little more details about the, uh, the company itself. So let's go and get to the unboxing. We'll pop it open like this. Kind of presentation very similar to like Spigen or something like that in terms of that price range. But $24.99 is a little steep. So that's a premium price. So we'll see if it's a premium case. Let's go and check it out. So the first thing I noticed, it's got this matte finish to it. Very nice finish to it. And you can see this is really one of those. It's kind of a weird. It's got exposed sides. And you can see all the ports are exposed, exposed bottom. So it's going to add definitely some, I mean, you're not going to get full protection, which is disappointing right out of the gate. Now, the, the other issue I have with this right here is the fact that that hump on the back looks huge. I mean, look, look at the, look at the booty. That is huge. That's a really thick back. You know what I'm saying, guys? That's thick. It reminds me of one of those Apple cases that have, I guess, the Apple battery cases that kind of with the thickness on the back where it's it's thin and then got that real thick back so it kind of feels very unnatural to the touch in terms of overall right there it doesn't look too bad but i in from an angle to me that doesn't look really clean as much as i would like here's the actual wall itself slides open like that which is pretty nice that you can see the how it just slides right open it slides closed so hopefully that stays protected and doesn't drop any of your stuff out you got a little vrs branding right there got a little bit of two-tone look now that gold it looks okay. It doesn't. Look, it looks almost like a pinky gold. I wish they had made that a little bit darker if they're going to add that accent. But why not? Maybe just keep it black, in my opinion. But it doesn't look terrible. So on the inside, got the VRS branding right there. Just a little more details about it. Not the most, you know, professional. It's kind of cheaply made. It's it's a little bit underwhelming in terms of overall protection because the inside is really not going to give you much protection. You can see on the inside, it's going to give you that border all the way around but then again the bottom is exposed all the ports are exposed so keep that in mind it's got a little bit of you know give to it but overall and it does kind of rattle a little bit as well but let's go and check it out and see if it's a hit oh so far i don't think it's worth that price point but we'll finish up the review you know i think this is maybe one of those cases that if it was maybe 12 13 bucks would we'll probably probably a better price point but for 25 bucks it would have to really overwhelm me, and I'm not sure if this is doing that. So let's go and check it out. So this is what you're going to get. So again, that hump just sticks out. So the camera protection. Now, you're really not getting much camera protection at all. It's quite flush. Now, with the hump, though, it's actually going to give you some more camera protection because it's not going to lay flat on the actual camera. So this right here is actually going to give you some more protection for that camera. So don't worry too much about that. Again, there's a slidey right there. We'll throw a couple cards in there real quick. Let's see if I got a couple cards to throw in. Try to see how it looks and how it feels. Slides right into place. So there's one. Let's see, there's two. Let's see how it slides. So that is pretty nice. You know, if you're just out on the town or something like that, that comes out pretty easy. So that is nice. That is probably sleek. It's probably one of the sleeker ones that I've seen in terms of wallet cases. That snapping effect, and it feels like it's not going to fall out or by any chance at all. It feels very, very secure. So I would give them that. Honestly, that is pretty much a nice design. I just wish almost maybe they would have kept this design a little bit you know, more fluid throughout the top and then maybe gave you a little more protection on the sides because you're really not getting much protection at all. Zero lip cover, so everybody wanted a fat lip is definitely not going to get a lot of lip coverage on this. So no lip protection. So if you drop it, it's definitely going to make some impact on that screen, your screen protector. Volume up and down is exposed. And again, why am I seeing, this is my kind of a beef. I wish they would probably cover this up and not make all the ports and then the bottom exposed. Because if you drop this, 
look, really, you're not getting any protection right. Let me try to get this into focus here. You can see the entire bottom is exposed. So if you drop it, it's going to make impact with that bottom part. There's really, right, you see that right there? There's really no way that's not going to make impact. So that's pretty much like almost raw dog in your phone at the bottom. You got a real big, you know, thick, kind of thick case, but without that protection. So why do that? I'm, that in my opinion, that's a design flaw. Everything right here is exposed, so easy access to all the ports and the alert slider. So overall, is this a hit or miss? To me, this is probably a big miss just because, and it kind of does rattle too. You hear that? That kind of annoy me, just just kind of little rattly. So that's one of the OCD things I got. But overall, I think they could have done this better, especially for that price point. Now, if they were throwing this to me like at 10, 12 bucks, I would think that's a different story. I might give it a relook, but for 25 bucks, We'll put this as a miss. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section. Is it a hit? Is it a miss? I think miss. Hit the subscribe button. We'll see you guys next time.